Welcome back to the channel guys Been sent this It's from Trust Fire. It's the Mini X3 Floodlight So they sent me the original one. Well, it wasn't the original one. They sent me this one oh, months and months and months ago and this has been an absolute rock star to be honest really good but they got back in touch with me asked me did I want to try the floodlight out and uh, oh my god it does exactly what it says on the tin it is a floodlight The actual size of it that's my hand and I haven't got very big hands so I put it in comparison with the first one they sent me whereas that one is a solid round this one is flat both got the the, the uh, clip the paper clip you can clip it up or down put that one up there so yeah, this has been really great. To check the battery life, you just click the top once and it lights up green. It goes green and then like an amber and then a red. It's got a slide function here. It's got the torch. You got a laser. And then the back one is for the, the side light because it's all magnetized, I'll show you in a bit. So you can stand it up. So it's absolutely, and the magnet on this one is insane. To operate it, it's just a long press on the top. I'll put it on the, that's the first setting, it's got four settings. So you got one, two, three, and four is the huge floodlight. And when you look at my thumbnail, compared to the lenses, they are tiny absolutely tiny and when it's on quick press on and if you want to press it off keep your finger on that but if you keep your finger on it longer it goes to a blue light and if you can see my trainers it highlights everything that's white So a long press brings the torch on. If you slide this forward, you get a laser. Now this laser just goes on for miles. It is insane. I have some good fun with Sage and the cats with this. Bring it back to the middle. You get your torch again. And then if you bring it down, I'll angle it so it's not on your face, you get the side light. So when you're working on something, you can put that on your engine or whatever and yeah it is really really bright so yeah the trust fire mini x3 floodlight now for me being with a dog in a van living full-time in a van at night time a torch is essential so yeah they were kind enough to get in touch with me see i've been rocking that one for months now and it's used every night i've had this now for about five is it five maybe six weeks so i've been putting it through its paces and it's an absolute it's just compared to that one yeah this does exactly what it does on the says on the tin it's a floodlight whereas that one is a beam and then you got like a little bit of an outer this just lights up the whole area so yeah this has been amazing as you can see it's just insane I'll put all the links where you can purchase this and I'll, all, everything for Trustfire will be in the description below of the video. So if you want to purchase one of these, click on the link and it'll take you straight to Trustfire where you can purchase one. So thank you very much Trustfire for sending me out the uh, Mini X3 Flood and uh, yeah, it's been, it's been amazing, it really is doesn't also just light up the dog you know when she's far away it just like I say it just lights up the whole area <laughs> and for the size of the lens you will not believe the distance this will light up it's insane 
absolutely insane so once again thank you very much for sending it and uh, see you soon guys just hang on a goddamn picking moment there is a discount code it is 10 a d so if you type in 10 a d when you get when you go to the checkout you'll get 10 percent off your purchase so yeah Bloody hell, didn't realise this was here. Bloody beautiful. The valley towards Slangothlin. Not the sun's blinding it, but yeah. Nice, just giving her a toilet break, eh? Oh. Christ, there's some steep steps. Bloody hell. Just dropped my daughter off now. I've had her for a few hours this afternoon, been brilliant. So, yeah. It's, oh my god, it's five to five. I've got to be somewhere in an hour. Because <laughs> these light nights now, you are forgetting what time it is. Bloody awesome. Sun's come out now, it's been out about an hour. Bloody beautiful. Pretty cool, you've got the sun one side, the moon the other side. No, you're not having your frisbee now, no. Bug it off. So you'll be throwing the bloody frisbee all day. It's only rubber, so I'll be glad when she chews it a bit. Because she will do. Okay. I'm gonna enjoy this coffee anyway. But not in slow motion. <laughs> oh dear me. Oh. Just you know when you're just having one of them moments where you just like Oh I seem to have been busy as hell today, but there's nothing to show for it. You ever have them days? Oh, this one? I bet you're guessing who's that? This is Anita, she's my other half, and uh, yeah, <laughs> welcome to the channel, <laughs> yeah, as I say, we're in Matlock Bath, the river's high, so she ain't going in, she's had a drink, let's have a look.
put it to. Got I put. Oh, it's bloody lovely. Plenty of sick areas. Bring your stuff, so I move on. <laughs> <laughs> Camera shy. And I feel awkward talking in front of her now, so I'm like, what the hell? Apparently this was uh, used for lead mining, using the river, and these like, a, I think they're like kilns. They're scattered all along this edge here, so yeah, really cool. See me now, I would have rock bands in there in the summer, and have all the people here watching. Sage, come here. Come here. That frightened you, didn't it? She just went for a swim in that. Stick some butter on it. Bloody lovely. It'd be rude not to. What do you want? Eh? Hey? Me. <laughs> God, I feel awkward doing this now with there you. <laughs> yeah, she's drying off nicely. Bloody hell, frightened me to bloody death when she went in that water. I don't think she realised how deep it was. Did you? No, you went straight under, head everything. So, still in Matlock Bay. Bath, I should say, not lock bath. Okay. So yeah, it's kind of making me think about my bikes when I used to have motorbikes. Yeah, I bloody miss it. Yeah. So a couple went past not long ago, and the smell reminded me of it. Yeah, they got that Pacific smell on the exhaust, and so bloody love it. The mountain rescue. Someone's gone in Japan. Never the dumb ones here, is it? Don't know what's going on. Uh, yeah. Mountain rescue, Range Rover, helicopter, now the police. Ah. 
What the hell's going on here? It's supposed to be peaceful. <laughs> and it's this one's birthday today. To anyone. It's not hanging round. Leave. Thank you. That's it normally. Yeah, we're in Castleton in the car park. And uh, just had uh, some sausage rolls and stuff. And uh, we're going to be making tracks now back to North Wales. So, but it's a lovely day today. The sun's out, blue sky. Yeah, it's a shame to leave this place, but I'll be back in a few weeks. Oh, yes. Just been to the toilets and everything now. See, so, I just had sausage roll four pound fifty for the sausage roll and it was only like that yeah won't be buying one there again you know what i mean could have got a greg's and had a, a pasty and a sausage roll yeah right we'll see you back in north wales <laughs>